How to fix couldn't sign in error, try again later in CapCut. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is me, Bipin Bisnin, and today I'll guide you and explain you on how you can fix the issue with signing in on CapCut. Well, first things first, you want to check your internet connection. Now, if you have a slow internet connection, you might have some error signing in. So you want to make sure that you're con connected to a strong internet connection. Now, if you have a strong internet connection and if you're still not being able to sign in, you may try and switch in between your networks. You might try and switch to mobile data or if you are on mobile data, try using Wi-Fi. However, in any case, now, if you're having error signing in, what you can do is make sure that you're updated to the latest version as well. If you are not on the latest version, you might have some issues signing in and you might get in-app error as well. So I'll always recommend you to update to the latest version of the app that you are using. The other thing that you want to try is wait. Now it might be the server issue as well. CapCut randomly has this issue. Even I have faced the issue a couple of times. So I just wait and I try it again or I try and reload the application. So simply close the application and then reload it again, relaunch it again and then try again. So this might fix the issue. But in any case, if this doesn't fix the issue, if you have been using CapCut for a long time and suddenly you are having this error, then you can simply go ahead and clear the data for that. You want to head into your settings. Then you want to head into the app section. Under apps, you can look in for CapCut. So simply search for CapCut and then scroll down and head into stories. First, try and clear the cache of it. And if this doesn't help, then you can go ahead and clear the data. Now remember, this will clear all the application's data. So if you don't want to lose its data, then you might not want to do this. But if not, then you can simply tap on delete and go ahead and relaunch the application and you should be good to go. So hope this helped you. Do like and subscribe and do not forget to leave a comment down below if you have any further issues.